Hey GES students, it's Miss Watts coming at you again from home. This week, instead of being in the driveway, we are in our hallway where there are lots of doors. All right, so we've been working on basketball related skills the past few weeks, and this week is no exception. We're going to be working on shooting. Um, I was inspired by Kobe Bryant's Deer Basketball video where he talked about shooting up uh, shooting his dad's rolled up tube socks. Uh, I also found some really cool videos from other PE teachers where uh, they used things that they found to do a shooting lesson. All right, so these are the things that you're gonna need. Um, you're gonna need some rolled up socks. So I've got this in a nice little ball, but you need some longer socks. So Kobe Bryant said that he used his dad's tube socks, so those are long socks, not the short socks. So you're gonna take those, line them up, fold it in half, and then you take the outside sock and you fold again and tuck it all into that. And so when you do that, you're gonna make a nice round ball, just like that, okay? Now if you have several pairs that you can do that with, you can make several shots at a time without having to go grab the ball, okay, or the socks. The other thing that you're gonna need is uh, kind of look around your house, be creative, see what you can see as a basketball uh, hoop. We actually have this, it's actually the uh, hamper hoops that I got out of my son's room, Jacob's room. So we have that one. We have this right here, uh, my younger son Lucas's basketball goal. Uh, then we also have the laundry basket with a nice backboard. And one thing that I love that another PE teacher shared, and I'll share his video too, is that he took a box and he cut the edges off. What I did is I just folded them up. So you remove the tape on the bottom of the box and you can fold them up or you can cut them off. On the top, same thing. You can cut the flaps off except for one and or you can tuck them in. I tuck them in. That way if we want to use this box again, we can. And apparently it used to hold broccoli. So you leave that one flap like that. And then what you're gonna do is you will open the door and wedge the flap up there and pull the door. You might not be able to close it because I'm not gonna be able to close this door. But you're gonna pull it until that box is secure okay so just to recap if you want to do several that's fine you can have several goals to shoot from um pick a box laundry basket small basketball goal hamper hoop or one of those hoops i'm going to need up some rolled up uh long socks all right go get those items and come back all right guys so before we get to shooting i want you to know and look at the cues for shooting we're gonna go with the PE Central cues. So these were found on PE Central, and they are the beef cues, okay? So when you're thinking about shooting, think about beef. All right, B for balance the ball on your shooting hand. So if your shooting hand is your right hand, that's where the ball balances, okay? So it's gonna balance on your dominant hand. If your dominant hand is your left hand, it will balance there. E for elbow stays directly under the ball and over your knee, all right? The other E is eye on the target, okay? So the front of the rim, keep that eye on the target. And F, follow through. Always a good follow through in many, many things that we do. So the follow through, snapping the wrist high over the head. Okay, so make sure you get that follow through in there. All right, so now we're gonna practice our beef cues. Um, we're just gonna be using this one for demonstration, but if you're like us and you ended up with a lot of different things uh, that you could use, you can set up a game to include shots from different um, goals, okay? So we're gonna be using this one. Uh, we've also marked with three different objects um, a three-point line, two, and then a one. So you can kind of set your own points 
Um, you could even play a game of pig or horse um, with your bowl up on the door if you've got it like this, okay? So I'm gonna go ahead and show you those beef cues. Okay, so I've got my ball, and my dominant hand is my right hand. Okay, so it's balancing there. And I've got my elbow where it needs to be. Okay, I'm looking at the top of the box, that's my rim. The top of the box is the, the um, rim. And then I'm gonna make sure I follow through. Hopefully this goes in. Ah, no. All right, it rolled right back to me, so I'm gonna try that again, see if I can get it in that box. All right, I made it. A three point shot. I can try that at all of the different points that I've marked and make a real game out of it. Like I said, if you're lucky with that, like us, with all these different goals, or even multiple doors for different basketball goals, then you can make a real fun game out of it, shooting from different points and different um, baskets. We need to roll those. Some of those socks need to be rolled into a ball. They'll shoot better. Woohoo! Woohoo! Alright, so make sure we're thinking beef when you shoot. Balance, elbow, eye, and follow through. Boys, if I wave and say thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. And Lucas, what do you what do you say about getting better at any skill? What do you have to do? I still need to practice. That's right. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it for this week. Um, I would love to see some pictures and videos of what you set up for your shooting lesson for this week. Um, I know you guys are really creative. Um, and probably came up with something really neat. If you are lucky enough to have a basketball goal in your driveway, then I would love to see some of your shooting skills as well. Um, go on there, make sure you watch the Kobe Bryant uh, Deer Basketball video, which is great. And then I'm also gonna post that other picture of a PE teacher and what they set up at their house. All right, um, special guest next week. Can't wait, they'll really help us out with our shooting skills. So look forward to that next week. And uh, till then, Stay busy, stay active, stay safe.